¿Qué pasó? Guys, I was upstairs and Fatima's like calling me. No sé qué pasó, pero let's go see what happened. Help! Help! A ver. ¿Qué pasó aquí? Es que yo estaba sentada aquí y me caí para atrás y se me vino toda la cortina. ¿Qué, qué le pasó, Fati? Estaba ahí sentada y de nada se, se cae para atrás con, con toda la cortina. Ayúdenme, no me puedo parar, está muy pesado. A ver, Fati, ayúdala. No, ahí se queda, vete así. No, ayúdame. Help. 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 Aquí va tu help. Ay. Ay, no, Kai, pero ¿cómo? Tienes que tener cuidado. Y no te tienes que estar sentando ahí, no, porque mira, después pasa esto. Ayuda. A ver, pues, I'll help you. Ay, 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 ya te atoraste. Come on. Go, 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 go. Oh, oh my goodness. goodness. Yeah. Que te vayas para atrás otra vez. Ahora sí, ponte a arreglar eso que me quiero bañar. Tú lo tiraste. Sí, cierto. ¿Y ahora cómo se van a bañar? Try to fix it. No, mira, ahora sí no se van a poder bañar. Van a estar todas pestosas. Ahí está bien, ¿no? No, 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 no te subas ahí. Te vas a caer otra vez. Guys, I was upstairs in the kitchen pues haciéndome algo de comer. Y de repente I heard like a loud bang. Which is a really loud bang. Y Fatima empezó a gritar y empezó como a hablarme. And I walked into this. Ay, no. Mira, no hagas eso. Por eso te caes. Por eso pasan estas cosas. Mira, no, no puedo arreglarlo. Y ahora cómo se van a bañar. Yo mejor ya me voy. <risa> pues ni modo, no me voy a bañar. <risa> mejor me voy a ir a dormir. <risa> Ay, mira. No, Camila, yo no te quiero ver toda pestosa, ¿no? En la noche te andas echando pedos. Mejor ya vente a bañar. Ay, ¿que tú te echas pedos o es fatty? Ay, oh, yo que voy a estar echando pedos. Ay, oh, sí. Yo sí tengo higiene. No como otras que no se bañan como por una semana. Woohoo! Oh, my sister getting a new job? What? What? What is this, Melissa? Guys, Melissa is getting a new job. Is this the end of McDonald's or what's going on? Maybe. Maybe? What do you mean maybe? You gotta go in for sure and yes. Okay, guys, Melissa has been at McDonald's for such a long time. It's been, what, two years now? Casi dos años. Casi dos años. Ya llevo tiempo diciéndole, y por su propio bien también, que she needs to go out there and expand herself, you know? She needs to go out there and find different opportunities. And the only way to do that is leaving the place you're in, which is the comfort zone, you know? Because if you're in a place for such a long time, you get comfortable being there. And the only way to find opportunities to better yourself, to expand, to grow, is by hopping from one place to another. All the time, you know? Building yourself the opportunities. It's what I'm always telling you. Lo que siempre estoy diciendo. Así que me gusta que vas a ir y vas a aplicar a new trabajos. And you're going to get out of there, you know? Because it's it's not good. Literally, looking for a new job, going from one place to another. The main goal, the main thing that happens is you expand yourself, you know? You grow mentally. And it creates different scenarios, different opportunities in your life. Así que tú al salirte y estar en new environments, conocer new people... Este, aprender new things, you know, porque en McDonald's ya sabes hacer todo. Entonces, si ya sabes hacer todo, aviéntate a un lugar donde ahora tengas que aprender a hacer otra cosa diferente. Porque nunca sabes para qué vas a ocupar aprender eso. Porque en un futuro, a lo mejor, you're gonna run a McDonald's, you're gonna run a restaurant, you're gonna run a store. Y tú al saber hacer diferentes cosas, te vas a facilitar y abrir la puerta para diferentes oportunidades. Entonces, guys, no siempre es about the money. No siempre es where you can get paid more, where you can get... You go in a job and you go in to different places con la intención de aprender cada vez más. Con aprender cada vez más, con aprender hacer nuevas cosas, en estar en diferentes environments. ¿Verdad, cabezón? Sí. Yo voy a ir por support. <risa> ya sé que la voy a acompañar. Yo quería ir, pero me mandaron a la chingada. <risa> les dije, oh, let's all go, you know, como familia para apoyar a Melissa. No, I gotta stay and babysit these girls right here. I gotta babysit this, este chango de aquí. ¿Y el otro changuillo dónde está? Dormido. ¿Dormido? Sí. Ah, bueno, pues no me da tanta lata. Ya, yeah, pues Camila está dormida, así que, ok, that's good. Right. I don't have to deal with her. It's just gonna be me and Melissa, you know, just girls, you know, going out, bonding. ¿Una date de cuñadas? Sí. Pero ya, yeah, guys, todo esto, Meli, te va a funcionar porque vas a crecer en every aspect of your life, mentally, spiritually, and energies, and, and just open yourself and put yourself in situations where it's going to create opportunities in your life. Entonces, qué bueno, qué bueno que after two years, vas a ahora empezar a buscar otros lados, and you're going to start applying to new places, and you're going to get to learn new different things and have different tasks. You know, change up the routine a little bit once in a while. It's good, it's healthy. Así que, ¿cómo te sientes? 
No sé, no, no estoy nerviosa, estoy como... No, y, y no deberías estar, además de emocionada, ¿verdad? ¿Estás sí. emocionada? Emocionada de, de pues de sí. Aprender algo nuevo de... y otro trabajo, otra rutina, va a ser otra rutina exactly, exactly for all you guys que o ya están trabajando o van a empezar a trabajar ya next year o en two years, tomen esto en cuenta, you know quédense en un lugar for a couple of months aprendan bien, aprendan, aprendan go to your job with joy, enjoy it in the most positive way, and then get out of there and go somewhere else and learn something else, you know todo eso, it's just gonna make you guys grow así como le digo a Melissa, todas esas cosas te funcionan y más cuando, when you're young y todo te estás creando las oportunidades for later on in the future, entonces, pues es good Melissa eso toda la suerte y al rato que llegues nos cuentas cómo te fue. Gracias. ¿Ok? Sí. <risa> Adiós. Adiós. Bye. Aplicas a muchos lugares, Meli. ¿Ok? Ya está en el carro. She's excited. ¿Hoy está en el carro? Oh, bueno. Guys, I'm just so excited for my sister. I'm really excited for her because I know that she's in the process of just building and building and getting to learn more things, looking for different routes that's going to set her up for the future, you know? I remember all the jobs that I've had. Guys, I've had so many jobs in my life that it's like, it's crazy to think about it. I remember there was a point when I was 16, 17, that during that time, I remember I had three jobs. Those two years, I was like three jobs back to back at the same time. I worked at restaurants. I worked at the same McDonald's my sister is working right now. I worked in that one for like almost three years. I was working in construction. I was even a babysitter for one of my really good friend's kids. Um, I was babysitting them since they were like little for, for a while, a couple months. And man, just looking back to it, honestly, me llevo a really good memory of literally doing all those things. I don't know how I was doing it because I would go to one job and then after that one, I would go to another one and then after that one to another one and then go to sleep and then repeat, 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 repeat. Pero yo me acuerdo que todo lo que hacía, every single thing donde yo estuviera, honestly, I always had such a great time. I was never bored guys. I was always being like right now, like I was just talking to everyone. I was always so like energetic, just learning so many things. And every single thing that me to do, like I would just learn it and I would be so excited because it's something that I didn't know. So I was going to learn. So I would get excited for that. Entonces esto pues como consejo, like in anything you do, just enjoy it the most you can. Aprovechalo because one day you're going to look back at it and you want to see it in a positive way. You want to be like, damn, like I was doing all that and I have such an amazing time. And you just take out of all that a good joy. And a good memory. So, it's muy importante, guys. Entonces, pues eso, las, las otras dos cabronas, Fati y Cami, no se van a salvar. Like, you know, gotta teach them the habits desde que están chiquitas para que aprendan a valorar, you know, a, a valorar las cosas. That it's not easy. It's hard work. It's enjoying what you're doing in the moment. Y echarle ganas. See everything in a positive way. Everything in a way of learning. Que todo lo que está pasando in the moment, every position you are in life, is literally just preparing you for the future. Because más adelante, you're gonna be in positions where you're gonna have to handle a lot of things in your plate and to handle those things in your plate you've had to had a training in the past and that training is building a discipline building a routine and enjoying what you're doing in the moment and there's todo, todo lo que pasa in nuestras lives in the moment is for a reason and it's for us to learn because there's better things and there's awesome things coming y que mejor manera que todo lo que uno va pasando ir disfrutándolo ir viviéndolo ir agradeciéndolo que es lo más importante así que I'm really excited for my sister and I'm, I'm just excited for, for everyone you know for everyone that's, that's going through a path and at the end of the day the path never ends. Hasta que el día que ya no estamos aquí, en este mundo es, is when the path is just over. Pero there's always a path and there's always projects to follow. Y que mejor que hacerlo de la mejor manera, enjoying them and having fun and trying to learn as much as you can. Because all that will just prepare you for later on for the next chapter of your life. It's like a show. Think about life like a show. Each stage you're passing, it's like, it's like a season. You gotta be hopping from season to season of your show, of your life. Entonces, one season, de esto se trata. You enjoy it, you like it, te llevas un good feeling from it and then on to the second season and then the third and then the fourth and then the fifth but you can't get to the fifth if in the fourth you didn't learn everything and you didn't enjoy everything then the fifth will open and then the sixth and then the seventh that's how it is entonces guys charle ganas y a seguir para adelante never give up on what you want and just keep going and going and going it. and with the big smile on your face and never thinking negative and knowing that everything that's happening it's for the best it's for a reason as long as you allow yourself to see it that way así que everything in the most positive way and I'm, I'm excited for everyone I'm excited for my sister I'm excited for my family. I'm excited for you guys. I'm excited for me. I, I just, I'm just, I'm just trying to enjoy the ride, you know? Entonces, that's the same way we all gotta be. We all gotta be in that pace and the same mindset. So, let's see. A ver qué dice. A ver al rato cuando llegue y nos cuenta a ver qué le dijeron. What happened? Okay, guys. So, Jessica and Melissa ya vienen llegando de buscar trabajo. <laughs> Meli, ¿cómo te fue? Platícanos. How, how was it? Where did you apply? How did it go? ¿Qué te dijeron? Ok, pues 
fui a preguntar si estaban hiring a four stores y me dijeron en tres stores que, que oh sí estamos hiring en esto y el otro bla 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 y ya me dijeron cómo me explicaron cómo aplicar y todo y todo okay. es muy buena onda y después hubo una tienda donde me dijeron oh sí pon tu número nosotros te hablamos mañana y después me preguntaron oh cuándo puedes hacer una entrevista y yo Right away, right, yeah. right away. Y, y le dije, le dije, oh, este, el viernes, y ya me dijo, oh, perfect, we're gonna call you tomorrow, y ya hacemos esto, y yo, oh, ok, ok. Oh, okay. Entonces, probablemente tenga ese, ese job. Where were you gonna work, or where you gonna apply, ok? Ok, los que me dijeron fue de Bath and Body Works. Oh, no. <laughs> The candles. Prepárense para los free candles. Para los candles. <laughs> Ahí me vas a ver todos los días. Ok, Bath and Body, ¿dónde más? Apliqué en Lululemon, que también fueron muy lindos. Okay. Apliqué en Amber Crombie. Y apliqué en Paxson, pero no me gustó cómo eran. ¿No? No. Entonces... Son muy dry. Yeah, no, they were a little rude. I don't know if they were having a bad day, pero ahí no. No, entonces, Bath and Body. Bath and Body works by... So, you have interview when tomorrow? Friday. Friday, you have an interview Friday. Ok, ok. Tengo que irme preparando para decir cha cha to McDonald's. Oh! Leaving McDonald's, ya. Yeah. Te va a ser bien porque, como te estaba diciendo, you're gonna get to learn new things que nunca has sabido. Vas a experimentar just different things. You're gonna be in different environments. Vas a hacer nuevos amigos. You're gonna meet new people. It's, it's gonna go good. Prepárate. I'm excited for you. And if you get that job ahí, me and Jessica are gonna be there every day. <laughs> sí. <laughs> Ay, espero tener el de Lulu Lemon primero. <laughs> It's gonna be what it has to be. Let's just wait a ver cómo te va y qué te dicen. And we'll keep you guys updated because donde Melissa trabaje, we are going. <laughs> hey guys, so right now I'm in my garage. I'm cleaning up a little because I want to organize, you know, clean the, the leaves que se meten en el garage. Um, just organize everything because winter's coming. It's gonna start getting cold. Así para poder meter los carros en the garage so they don't get full of snow. So I just want to organize the garage and make it look pretty. So today is actually one of those days where it's really really nice well not that nice it's like 67 degrees outside which is really nice for us here the people in Chicago because the weather can be really crazy here sometimes like in Halloween you guys saw in the video it was snowing like it felt like Christmas it didn't even feel like Halloween yeah so today is really nice and I told the girls I was like que el día que it's really nice and this is one of like the last few days que va a estar así pues bonito and I told the girls I was like let's go outside para que se suban en las bicis for like one last time para que se pase and just enjoy you know because I'm gonna have to put the bikes away and just save them for next summer and yeah so they're riding their bikes right now let me show you guys wow mira Camila ya estás ready si sí, ya estoy ready para darme mis vueltas sexys tengo mi casco <laughs> mi protección sexy yeah. y mi bicicleta sexy wow yeah. Ay, ay, ¿dónde cayó? Wow, ya estás lista tú. Ay, pero ya estoy triste porque pues ya se van los días bonitos. Sí, ya se van ahí, ya viene winter. ¿Están listos para winter? Sí, ya quiero que neve. Pues yo voy a extrañar summer, pero... Te voy a extrañar summer, pero pues yo estoy lista para winter. Aunque siempre voy a ser la mejor ciclista. Oh, ¿es cierto, Cami? No, yo voy a ser la mejor con mi bicicleta sexy, mi vuelta ay, sexy. Ay, límpiate mejor los mocos, se te está saliendo. Guys, estamos aquí también con Valerie, my sister. También she's gonna go bike riding with the girls. Are you ready? Yeah. ¿Tú, Fati? Sí. Ok, a ver. ¿No se te ha olvidado, verdad? No. A ver, pues enséñame that you're the best. I'm riding your bike, a ver. Oh my god, Ida. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching all the way to the end of this video. We really hope you guys enjoyed it. Today's very biggest spa shout out to go to a very huge spa shout out to Alex Castellanos. A very big and special shout out to Jonathan. Un saludo muy especial para Antonia. Y finalmente un saludo muy especial para Noemi. Once again, thank you all so much for all the love and support. Muchísimas gracias por ser parte de esta familia. En verdad los queremos muchísimo. If you guys want a shout out in the next vlog, let us know down in the comment section what was your guys' favorite part of this video. And you guys will get a chance to get a shout out in the next vlog. Also, if you guys are not subscribed to the channel, subscribe right now. Drop a big like in this video right now guys and also turn on post notifications so you guys can be updated every time we drop a new vlog esperemos que todos ustedes se encuentren muy bien que Dios me los bendiga cada uno de ustedes a sus familias we hope everyone has an awesome day and we will see you all in the next vlog adios sexys